Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about surface area of a square pyramid. Our example, a square pyramid measures 10 cm on each side and a slant height of 12 cm. Find its surface area. What is surface area? The surface area of any solid figure is the sum of the areas of all its surfaces or faces. How does a square pyramid look like? A square pyramid is a pyramid with a square base, four triangular sides, five vertices, and eight edges. The base of this pyramid is a square, and the top point is the apex. The pyramids of Giza are one of the oldest examples of square pyramids. So based on our given, we have 10 centimeters on each side of the base. So that is going to be here, 10 cm and 10 cm. We also have a slant height of 12 cm. Our slant height is over here. We call that as our slant height, which is 12 centimeters remember that we have one square base so we have to get first the area of the base which is the square so how are we going to get the area of the base the formula of finding the area is side times side or s squared now we're ready to solve for the area of the square or our base let's have 10 centimeters times 10 centimeters that will give us 100 centimeters squared. This is only for the area of our base, which is the square. Now let us solve for the area of one triangular face. After solving for one area of the triangle, then we can just multiply it to 4 because we have 4 triangular phases. Do you still remember the formula in finding the area of a triangle? It is 1 half times base times height. Let's have 1 half, copy 1 half, then what's the measurement of our base here? That's 10 centimeters. And our slant height here is 12 centimeters. So we'll solve. 10 times 12 is 120 centimeters squared times it to 1 half. What's 1 half of 120? That is 60 centimeters squared. This is only for one triangular face. Remember that we have 4, so we will just multiply this one to 4. That's going to be, let's multiply it to 4. The answer would be 60 centimeters squared times 4. The answer is 240 square centimeters. This is for the area of the four triangular faces. We're ready to solve for that surface area. So that's going to be 100 centimeters squared plus 200. 40 square centimeters that will give us a total of 340 square centimeters so the total surface area of this square pyramid is 340 square centimeters another example mr and mrs falsies want to make a tent that is in the shape of a square pyramid for their summer camping adventure they wanted to have a base of 9 feet wide and a slant height of 10 feet. How much canvas will they buy? How much will they spend if one square foot of canvas costs 200 pesos? Our given, we have base of 9 feet by 9 feet. And we have a slant height of 10 feet. Slant height will be here. This is our... The slant height, which is 10 feet. Since we're looking for the surface area of this problem, it means we have to find first area of the base. Our base is square, so let's have area of the base. The formula is S times S or S squared. One side is 9 feet. That's going to be multiplied to 9 feet. 
9 times 9 is equal to 81 square feet. This is the area of our base. Now we are ready to solve for the area of the four triangular faces. Let's have first the area of one triangle. That's going to be one half times base times height. We have one half. What's the base? That's nine feet times the height that is 10 feet. 9 times 10 is equal to 90 square feet. What's the one half of 90? That's 45 square feet. This is just the area of one triangular face. We will multiply it to 4 because we have 4 faces. So that's 45 times 4. Let's solve that. 45 times 4 is equal to 5 times 4 is equal to 20 right 0 carry 2 at the top of 4 4 times 4 is equal to 16 plus 2 80 we have 180 square feet for the four faces that are triangular we are ready to solve our surface area. We'll just add these two um, area. That's going to be surface area equals 81 square feet plus 180 square feet. That's going to be, we have 261 square feet. Mr. and Mrs. Falsies needs to buy 261 square feet of canvas for their tent but this is just the answer in the question number one we are looking for how much will they pay for this if one square foot is 200 pesos it means we will just multiply 261 times 200 pesos that will give us okay let's solve that now let's multiply 261 times 200. We can put two zeros at the back to make our solution faster and easier. We can have zeros, two zeros here, and then we can multiply two times one, that's two. Six times two is 12, carry one at the top of two. Two times two is equal to four plus one is five. That's going to be 52,002. Pesos. This means that Mr. and Mrs. Falsies have to pay 52,200 pesos for their 261 square feet tent. And that's all. Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!